All right, a quick update on XYO here. So as we can see on the chart here, you could have said the uptrend was broken back here. We drew this new one here, but I did double it up. Uh, and we were trying to hold the 618 here, but of course the market had other plans. So this one just not coming into play here. Now, as long as we're below the 618 here, there's nothing really to stop us from dropping. You can see we're already making a lower low with that candle here. Even if we were to draw the fib from this low to the high, we're already breaking down below that low. So as long as you're below 005 here on XYO, then there's really nothing stopping you from dropping down to your last support here, a 16 to 17% drop to the 786 at 0041 here. So that does appear to be where the price is headed. Yet another one that broke the uptrend and it's coming all the way down to that 786 support level. So you still got some more downside on XYO in my opinion. Now just keeping it simple until you get back over that 55 level where you're not bullish as long as you're below the 236 which you can see it hit that 618, hit that perfectly at that macro 236 at 0062 and that's where it came right back down. So I would look for that price to get hit down here and of course we're not bullish on XYO until it gets back over the 382 at one penny and we'll just have to cover it when it gets there at some point in the future now just pretty much going from where we are today how high can xyo go this cycle we do have that new high at the 1272 at almost 21 cents a 2.7 billion market cap and you can see that would give you about a 42x on your investment here and if it's only going to do a 786 retracement this cycle uh still a decent move here up to four pennies would give you an 8x on this one here so what are your thoughts comment down below none of this is financial advice and i'll see you in the next one peace out